what, what the mate is talking about. What's up, family? Most of you already know this, but apparently some don't. So I'm going to share something with you. Cars are beautiful. They are a wonderment. They can bring you a whole lot of joy, but they also can be very dangerous and bring you an extreme amount of pain. My son is a car freak. I mean, ever since he was like a little kid, he would be fascinated by cars. And the older he got, he started recognizing the make and model. Something I can't do, you know, unless I just know, oh, that's a BMW, that's a Mercedes. I see the emblem right there. That's a Honda, you know, that's me. Having looked under the hood of a vehicle and I don't know how long, I know two things about cars. I'm gonna fix two things. I'm fixing the gas and I'm gonna fix the oil. When those lights come on, I get that fixed. Other than that, you miss me. But I tell him all the time about cars before he get behind the wheel. Safety first. Because if you don't respect that vehicle, you can kill yourself or kill somebody else. It can be very dangerous. Y'all see the, the carnage out there on the highways every year, especially around holidays. So many people get killed. Uh, operating motor vehicles and kill people operating motor vehicles. And it's sad, but it's especially sad and frustrated when somebody purposely caused an accident. This woman is riding with her dude. She mad at him about something and she reaches and takes the key out of the ignition and dude crashes shortly after. Now, apparently it was amateur night because what he should have done is just move the gear into neutral and then he could have just, you know, got over and everything would have been all right. But the fact that this woman was that callous that she could do something like that that could have gotten both of them killed. That's a problem, fam. That is very problematic. And she's not the only one I've actually seen do something like that before. I've seen people actually fight while operating a motor vehicle. I've seen the passenger or the person in the back seat fighting the driver. What's going on, fam? Damn. It cannot be that serious, whatever it was. She had a death wish. But I'll say this, fam. I've always wondered what it would be like to take the key out of the ignition while I was driving. <laughs> you know, like going about 50, 60 or whatever. I always wonder what that would be like. Now I know. No more talk. What the talking about?